Isis and Osiris, the first love story in history. Hello, my name is Isis, and I will tell you my story. I live in the era of the pharaohs. We believe in the existence of the god of the earth, called Geb, and the god of the heaven, called Nut. Geb and Nut got married, then they had four children, two boys called Osiris and Set, and two girls called Nephthys and me, Isis. The pharaohs believes that brothers can marry their sisters, so Set and Nephthys got married. Also, Osiris and I got married. I was so happy. I loved Osiris so much. At this time, my husband was the king who ruled the whole country. He was very fair and popular among his people. Our brother Set was jealous and very angry of Osiris because he wanted to rule the country himself, so he decided to get rid of our brother. He made a trap to kill my husband and became the king himself. Set decided to have a party and invited all the people and the most important person is Osiris. It was a very big and luxurious party. We were surprised when Set brought a huge box which was made in an elaborate manner. It was a golden box. Then he said it was a golden coffin and it is a gift for anyone who has the same measurement with it. No one knew that he designed the coffin with the same size as my husband. Everyone was happy and started to lay inside the coffin to check if they had the required measurements or not. They were all depressed because no one had the required measurements except Osiris, who fitted the coffin exactly. Set closed the coffin while Osiris was still inside it and threw it in the Nile River, thinking that this way he would get rid of him forever, but he was wrong. I was shocked and felt very sad. I thought that I had lost my husband forever, but my love is very strong, so I decided to search for my husband's body. My search continued for many days, and when I finally found him, he was dead. Unfortunately, when Set knew that I found my husband's body, he took it away from me and ripped the body into 42 pieces. Not just that, he also threw every piece in a different place through Egypt. I didn't give up and started collecting the pieces of my husband's body together. After I collected all the pieces, I asked help from Anubis, the god of embalming and the dead, and together we restored Osiris alive. We were finally together again, but happiness didn't last too long. We had our son Horus, but my husband Osiris couldn't stay alive anymore. I said goodbye to my beloved husband, Osiris, who became the god of the underworld, and I tried to protect my only son from Set. I decided to raise my son well and make him strong enough to take revenge of Set and become the king, the ruler of Egypt when he grew up. That was my own story. Tell me what you think about it. And if you want to hear the rest of it or similar stories, please subscribe to the channel and drop a like if this video affected you. Thank you for watching.